I want you to hear an exchange between uh, Sean Hannity and Ted Koppel. Play it, guys. We have to give some credit to the American people that they're somewhat intelligent and that they know the difference between an opinion show and a news show. Yeah. You're, not, you're cynical. Look at that. Yeah. I am cynical because, uh, you know. You think we're bad for America? You think yeah. I'm bad for America? Yeah. You do? In the, in the long haul, I think you really? and all these opinion That's shows. That's sad, Ted. No, you know why? That's sad. Because you're very good at what you do and because you have, you have attracted a significantly you more influential. The well, let me finish the sent, Let me finish the sentence I'm before listening. you do that. With all due respect, you yes. Take you have point. you have attracted people who are determined that ideology is more important than facts. All right, I, I know you're no fan of Sean Hannity. I am. I've known him forever. It seems, uh, and uh, I respect what he does, and he's very good at what he does, obviously. But where do, you, do you believe he's bad for America? And, and Koppel saying, you know, you've attracted people who care more about ideology. Duh! Has he looked at any other cable show on any network? Yeah, it's a little ridiculous. Look, I give, I give Hannity credit for going on Koppel's show. I mean, that was not, you know, he didn't have to do that, right? I mean, that was, he went into what he felt probably knew would be somewhat hostile territory. I guess I give Koppel credit for saying what he believes. I mean, I don't think Sean Hannity's bad for America. I'm not sure I think Sean Hannity's. I mean, mostly, honestly, the people watching Sean Hannity agree with Sean Hannity. I don't think he's changing a lot of minds one way or the other. I do think there's a bit of a problem of a bubble on both sides where people just hear people they agree with. And you do want to make sure you can answer the arguments of, you know, the other side. And that's why I try to read magazines I don't agree with and, and so forth. But I actually think they both come out fairly well from that exchange in, a, in an odd way. You know, they both said what they believed and had the nerve to say it to each other's face. And uh, it, wasn't, it well, wasn't a bad thing for America. <laughs> although we should point out that Sean rightfully would like the whole uh, interview release. He yeah, says it was no, that's edited. A very fair, yeah. I think that's a very fair request, actually. Yeah. You know what I mean? That That is a good, I mean, but again, that gets back to sort of transparency. I think as long as people are willing to make their case and put the whole thing out, that's a good thing.